Alright, welcome back everyone to another Tech Zone tutorial and today I'm going to be showing you how to create a cool looking intro in Sony Vegas Pro. So this is really easy if you follow the steps. So this is how you do it. Right click and click insert video track and insert some text media and we're going to type it as oops halo okay and uh, then after that I'll change the font to a halo font and now we're going to make it look a bit 3D so on the compositing mode 3D source alpha and track motion now it's going to sort of rotate all this time so uh, at the beginning the orientation on the orientation y axis it will be 35 and at the end of that clip should be minus 35 it should be exactly the same but minus something like that so let's take a look so as you can see it's sort of rotating now we can duplicate the track and then after that video effects the tab scroll down to glow reset to none add it to the second track glow percent 0 0.83 0 0.83 um, and in set intensity 1.2 probably color will be sorta of green then on the video effects again go to Gaussian blur and drag reset to none onto the second track again this time horizontal range will be around 0 0.5 so uh, this is the preview it's sort of blurry but there's no special effect but wait this is where the magic happens insert another video track do not duplicate that's very important don't duplicate the track again and the media generators go to noise texture standard noise and then the compositing mode of that will be dodge. Now it should look a bit like glowing, but wait. There's one more thing we have to do. At the beginning of that noise texture clip, scroll down and you should get progress in degrees. It should be zero. Drag this to the end, insert a new keyframe, and progress will be 10. Now let's take a look. Okay, I'm gonna reduce it because it'll slow it down. Let's take a look. See now the text is sort of glowing and it really looks cool, so that's why I did that. Now that's done with the text, let's make the background. So let's add another type of video track, but it will be behind the others. Because if you add it in front, then you cannot see the text. That's why we had to do that. Now we're going to add microscope, microscopic threads. Let's add that. So it should behind, be behind all of them. Right click, edit. Let's change the color. Color A will be blue. Color B will be black. Okay, I'll just increase this to full. You can see better. Now, you can't see very well, so let's reduce the number of layers to a little bit more or less. But it looks a bit more jelly-like. You can add others also. You can add lava. I recommend that. Moss. There's some at the bottom, but I just want to finish this. Uh, okay, I'm just going to change the color. That looks weird. Okay, dark green probably. And, okay. So just like for the standard noise, beginning progress will be 0. At the end, progress will be 10. Let's take a look. See? Sort of like jiggly jaggly. But it look the background looks a little plain, so I'm just gonna have one more. Uh well I don't know if it's necessary. Let's just add dodge again. Yeah, it looks creepy. Hold on. I'm just gonna reduce the opacity. Just drag it down. Okay, not dodge. I think it's add. It's add. Okay, let's add. So do it like this. Edit the media. And color B will be. I'll make it a little blue. 
and number of layers. Who's gonna know? Okay, again the progress at the end, progress will be 10. Let's take a look. I don't know if you can notice anything, but still, it looks a little better. And finally, the lens flare. This is happening to me because my microphone's sort of broken. Okay, I think my Vegas got stuck. Okay, for the final touch, <coughs> lens flare. So, uh, let's go to video effects, lens flare, reset to none. Um, add it to okay. Add it to the background, whatever the background it is. I'll add it to the first one, microscopic threads. Increase the intensity to show the light. And change the lens type to sunburst. Now over here, just drag it to move it up. So at the beginning, it'll start from there. As you go on, it should start moving quickly. And at the near end, it slowly fades out. Just reduce the intensity. There we go. Final look. Okay, now I'm going to produce the video. And then I'll show you. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. If you did, why don't you subscribe for more.